fellow YouTube denizens, David Storm here with picklocks.com. And I thought I'd show you tonight a, a few tools that I use for attacking the Master M5. Now, uh, this is by no means a high security lock, but for a Master, it's pretty tough to pick. So I thought I'd show you a couple tips and tricks that I use to get through these uh, pretty fast. So the first tool is the ALS tension tool which was uh, designed by Kelly Allwood and uh, it's called the Allwood Lock Sport Tension Wrench and you see there on the tip you see this tip a lot in uh, different tension wrenches like flat style but what's different is it's cut on both sides instead of just one side and so what that means is when you have that inside the lock uh, in, t in the top of the plug it keeps it from kicking out it really bites good Plus, he has some ergonomic features uh, that allow you to put this in and apply pressure this direction or with your thumb catch this portion, which is what I'm going to be doing uh, for this because on these uh, M5s, what I want to do is I want to pick this backwards. I've picked it forwards and backwards and uh, backwards is uh, a lot easier. I'd say it's, it's twice as hard to go forward as it is uh, backwards on this lock. So let's take a look at what we got here. I'm just going to rake it and I'm using a uh, de standard DeForest pick. So I'm going to rake these pins here. And uh, I really like raking. A lot of people like the lifter pick and I've certainly used a uh, lifter style picking but I just uh, I've, I've been raking for many years and I really really like raking especially on these lower security locks. So, just getting a feel for the pins here. Sometimes these fall right open and sometimes they don't. I have to say that it's been a while since I picked on video and the video camera kind of gets in my way compared to picking this in my hand, but let's see what we can do here. All right. Very close. got uh, most of the pins set. I'm kind of looking for the one in the front there. Maybe a little bit more pressure. There we go. That was a good set. I've got, it, uh, got the back pin set. It feels like there's a high back pin there. And sometimes I'll do a little lifter picking once I get toward the end. But I like to rake and see what I can catch in the beginning. Switch over to my finger there. Normally this would be in my, my hand and I'd be using my thumb to apply that pressure. So I'm kind of, I think I'm going to switch over like that and see if I can get that feel. Taking a lot longer than it normally does on this, but this really isn't the point of the whole video, how long it's taking. Um, this portion, I wanted to show you the second portion. Obviously, if we weren't in the top of the lock on this, we wouldn't be able to uh, pick this backwards because of these wards right here. So, top picking this is the only way to go backwards on it. Another little feature that's on the Master M5 and some other Masters. And of course, as usual, you turn the camera on and it takes you three times as long to pick it as it did the ten times you picked it in a row before you started the camera. <laughs> but that's the way it goes. All right, let's try this again. There is a high back pen. I don't have the key to this because a lot of my locks are given to me uh, by people that lose the key and no longer have a use for it. There we are, we have it picked. Now, the secret weapon number two is a plug spinner. So I'm going to cock this once, twice, and third time is the charm. This particular one is a very old one I got. Um, it's an A1 security. This is from the 80s. So this is, I got this when I was about 16 years old and I was locksmithing. So the second thing I want to do is I want to take this tension 
off of the shackle. Because if you try this without taking that tension off the shackle, it won't work. There it's flipped. Use the tip to continue that turning motion. And there it is. The M5 backwards picked and then flipped using a, a plug spinner and opened. So these are these are nice little locks uh, for a master and for what they are. So uh, if you're having if you're struggling with that, that might be a tip that helps you open these, pick it backwards and use a plug spinner to uh, to flip it back around. And as you can see right there, it's the uh, the M5. I don't know if you can see that or not. So there you are, ladies and gentlemen. I'm David Storm with PickLocks.com. If you like our videos, please click on the like, uh, share our videos, and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.